Switching to college baseball, we head to Niagara University where the men's baseball program is off to one of its best starts in over two decades. I got a chance to talk to the coaching staff and a few of the newest Purple Eagles to learn more about the remedies of their recent success. The Niagara University men's baseball team is taking a different approach to pregame warmups. Inhale energy. Breathing, you know, and visualization audio that we listen to every day before practicing games is just to try to get us centered. Implementing routines like this, Coach Rob McCoy says, is all part of the process that helps meet the standard of what the Purple Eagles are all about. We're really big on the mental game and, and you know, team cohesion and things like that that are more than just the game. McCoy took over the program in 2009. He says it's not always easy, especially with the new era of the transfer portal. If you have a bad year or two bad years in a row, then yeah, you're you're at the mercy of what whatever happens, but you, we still, we're still going to try to get the kid that's a fit for us. Eric Radicek is a perfect example of what the Purple Eagles look for in an experienced recruit. This is my first year at the program, and if you would have told me with this that this is the team culture and the, the standards that are expected around here, I would never guess that this year is more or less successful than the other years. The 23-year-old has played all over the country at the junior level, D1, and club. Eric even took a break and focused on academics until quickly realized that I my love for baseball was was much further than my uh, love for academics. After spending some time playing club baseball in Canada, still in search of a college team, Eric decided to take a page out of his father's manual to success and bet on himself. My dad's been a great example of someone who's followed his dreams his entire life. Um, and, and turn it into a profession. The hard work Eric's parents have instilled in him is what keeps him motivated. He's currently top three in conference for his batting average and top 40 in the country. He's got pro aspirations and he's getting he's gotten interest from three or four teams and and so it's a it's a success story for him. The success the junior redshirt hopes will lead him to the majors while bringing the Purple Eagles their first championship in program history. Reporting from the studio, Brianna Aldridge, Seven Sports.